This was the man that I was talking about to begin with, John Singer Sargent, and while his paintings are beautiful, um, I was using it as a baseline for controversy. Then we moved on to Georgia O'Keeffe. So this is the textbook that's made for um, public education. This was uh, the textbook that I had in my room and the textbook that the teacher before me had in her room. The principal informed me that even though uh, she said that I wasn't aware of the policy, um, but that doesn't make me exempt from the policy, that uh, I wasn't allowed to discuss reproductive health without prior approval. Just saying the word vagina, regardless of the context, constitutes reproductive health and therefore constitutes violation of the policy. So is the policy right? Well, that I do understand both sides of the story and that I get why I was removed, but I also want to open up the conversation about why this policy is in place and why it was interpreted in the way where it is not allowed in art history. I've gotten emails from parents of my students who are like, my kid misses you, and they, they think that this is a little silly, but we stand behind you. I think that we have been conditioned to think that the body part is a very sexual organ, and any context, regardless of whether you're talking about reproductive health or not, is a sexual connotation, and I think that's a really damaging um, idea to to perpetuate because when you perpetuate an, an idea of shame around a body part then I think it creates an aura of shame. Um, so I did leave them a letter that I hope that the substitute who's now subbing for me uh, will read to them. I just miss them a lot.